what up everyone, it's Kiritan Singh and I'm back with a brand new video. Today I am watching the Rise of Skywalker trailer live. Yes, I am very late with getting this done because I was at placement today so I just got back. What time is it? 5.43. I was avoiding social media. I was actually awake at 1am this morning because I thought it would be up this morning but it came out 1 p.m. or so in Australia so I'm going to watch it live now I'll put the footage in the bottom corner and let's see the trailer I am really nervous about this oh, I was listening to Star Wars music I have my headphones over here and I was listening to Star Wars music and stuff on the way back as well just a little bit to get me a little hyped Oh god, because I was watching Revenge of the Sith the other day and I'm getting really emotional and everything when it comes to Star Wars. It's just, it just means too much to me. Okay, playing the trailer. Okay. <laughs> oh. Oh, okay. Ooh, nice transition. Force brought us together. We're not alone. Good people will fight if we lead them. Oh my god. Is this Endor really? Keep telling me they know me. I'm not sure. No one does. Oh, oh, that's a cool shot. Kylo ran in the water. Oh wow. Whoa, holy crap. That ice. Oh my god, what? What, uh, what are you doing there, 3 PO? Taking one last look, sir. At my friends. 3 PO, what are you doing? Oh, I see I killed 3 PO. Y wings are back, one of my favorite ships. Did they just destroy some artifact or something? Or the Sith artifact or um So the Emperor was on like some claw machine walking thingy and he's a it looks like he's actually back physically which is which is uh I don't know how I feel about that. I was honestly we're a look at the new I was honestly expecting to be very emotionally driven and very sad by what I was seeing but that was that was all right as a trailer uh I still don't know what's going on. All I know is that the Emperor is coming back. It looks like he did have a plan for after his death and whatnot. Um, I was hoping for more Lando in the trailer, but if, you know, maybe they ha don't have much of him in the movie, so they're not giving much of him in the trailer. I really don't know, and I'm really unsure about this movie itself right now, because I thought I was just really expecting more from this trailer, and it's cool and all. I love the Kylo Ren shot. I never expected Dark Ray to be a real thing, and it's no surprise that they didn't put it here either, either. but you know, it's cool seeing her train on that forest planet. It really doesn't seem like the Death Star 2, or the destroyed Death Star wreckage is on Endor by the looks of it. I'm really not sure. And, but I just love all the heroes that are together. I just love that everything's coming together as one. Kylo Ren, hopefully his character's not ruined. I'm just really surprised by this ice planet. That shot looks so good. Seeing this throw in the Emperor's monologue. And then the Star Destroyer coming out. I'm really intrigued by what's going on. This has to be that same show where it has all those Star Destroyers and the lightning strikes and everything. That's probably it. But what's most interesting is that the Emperor is in that throne thing. And I also saw they destroyed Kylo Ren and Rey destroyed this artifact-like thing 
which is very interesting. You have those beasts riding on a Star Destroyer. It's very, very unique, to say the least. And I'm just very intrigued by what's going on. It seems very confusing, but, but at the same time, it also just seems a little forced. I know, I know, I love the Emperor coming back, and I know it reacted really greatly when I first saw him, but he doesn't make sense for him to come back. Hopefully this story, this movie can justify it, but this trailer hasn't really given me much hope of the Emperor's return being justified. It still seems like a bunch of teasers. The fight seems cool. It was weird when I just saw a bunch of stormtroopers falling down as Rey and Poe were, not Rey and Poe, Finn and Poe were gunning through them. Very easy for them to do. Very intrigued by the 3PO line. Hopefully they don't kill him. That suck a lot if they just start killing every move they kill off someone from the original trilogy. I would really hate that. Lando better not die. But honestly, this trailer, it's probably the best thing we've got so far because we didn't get a Dark Ray plot twist, which we obviously know is fake. We got a little more glimpse at the Emperor and, you know, we got a little better glimpse of everything, really. Um, yeah, it's a fine trailer. I'm excited for the movie. No matter what, I'm going to go watch this movie. No matter what, I'm going to be really happy when I go watch this movie. But, <sighs> I don't know. With just over a month left to go until this movie comes out, whew, um, I still have some doubts about how good it's going to be. Alright, so that is my reaction to the Rise of Skywalker trailer. If you've enjoyed this video, hit that like button. Make sure you subscribe to my channel for more videos. And leave a comment down below on what you thought about the trailer itself. And until next time, I'll see yous.